Side chaining is a great way to have one track act as a control source upon a plugin that's inserted on another track. I'm going to give you an example. Here's a drum loop with some sustained notes. Now I'm going to take a gate plugin and put it onto the track with the sustain chords. And I'm going to take this and copy it down to a new track. And on this copy, I'm going to have the output routed to the input of this gate plugin. So now this gate plugin is going to be acting upon these sustain chords, but based on the rhythm of this drum track. And further, the attack, hold, and release can be used to shape the envelope. So that's side chaining.